K-pop fans and stars, we hold the world race show on us. Hello, K-pop fans. Welcome to the second round of Glamour Audition in Mongol. Mongol is close to Korea, but people from its country do not know much about our country. But the Korean wave is taking great part of Mongolia's lifestyle. Even people are making TV programs by K-Wave magazine, which specializes in Korean wave. Even though weather was poor, people gathered for the audition. What in the world happened in Mongol? Okay, are you ready for the show? Let's get it started! Beautiful steps seem to stretch on forever. Mother Nature is preserved just as she is. The descendants of Genghis Khan live here. This is Mongolia. Let's look at Korean wave in Mongolia today. The Korean department at the National University of Mongolia in Ulaanbaatar, the country's foremost university, is very popular and thus difficult to get into. Korean is Mongolia's second foreign language. Another common place is a Korean-style supermarket. Demand for Korean food products is high, given their quality and the name value of Korea. A Mongolian broadcasting station. Interest in K-pop is so great that an entire show is based on K-pop magazine. There's a young woman with a special story. Oyanga has returned from studying in the States to take part in the festival. Global Edition Mongolia is about to kick off. A large number of people have come for the K-pop World Festival. Backstage, rehearsals are underway as contestants hope to win. We spot a familiar face. It's Oyanga, whom we met the day before. Global Edition Mongolia finally starts after the opening acts. The first team takes the stage as the audience cheers them on. Bill Gong, wedding dress. Jung Doram, change. Starlight, love is move. Ingeja 
Madagascar, Fantastic Baby. Ochida Bat becoming dust. Gangnam Style. <laughs> Oyanga, you and I. <laughs> I will show you. <laughs> UB Dance K pop dance remix. The editions are over, and it's now time to announce the winner. <laughs> Oyanga is named the winner for her emotive and magnetic voice. <laughs> Despite the rain, Mongolia's love for K-pop was powerful and impassioned. We'll never forget Mongolia's love for K-pop. Wow, the participants are really enthusiastic about K-pop. Even the weather cannot hold them back. Do you think that Oyang Girl will survive through the audition and make for the final? We better find out in the future. The heat of global audition is getting hotter and hotter. Coming up next, the Dome K-pop World Festival in Russia will be on air. Don't miss it, and see you next time, K-popers. I love K-pop World Festival.